Um, this is a tutorial um, of when you say a song that I wrote that is based on some pretty basic chord shapes with little variations that um, give the chords a little more color, a little more distance, make them a little bit prettier than they already are. Um, these are pretty much chords that I'm sure you've you've seen or you've played before. I'm sure you've heard them before because they're in the song. So yeah, let's get started. First four chords account for the intro, um, the verse, the chorus, and interludes, the parts where you're not singing. This is what um, is playing the little instrumental parts. So yeah, let's get started. First chord is an E. It's a variation on an E, and it looks and sounds like this. Let me get closer for you. next chord is a variation on C sharp minor 7 and that looks and sounds like this I'm trying to give you a there we go that might help. in the little diagrams um, I should note whenever you whenever you see an X you don't play so you're not playing this you're not playing the sixth string um, and whenever you see an O or a zero, you play it open, so you're not holding any frets, as you can see. Okay. Third chord is a variation on F sharp minor seven, which looks and sounds like this. A little Spider-Man action for you. And what I'm doing here, <clears throat> there's an X, right? So it's on the fifth string. I'm not playing it, I'm using my thumb to mute it. You see there's no tone coming out because it's just barely touching it, not letting it vibrate. And then these two, of course, are open. So that's that. And the final chord is a variation on uh, a B7. And that looks and sounds like this. And of course, that has the X on the um, sixth string, so you don't play that. And open on these, uh, on these two, so you're not holding those, and you just play it like that. <clears throat> cool. Um, those chords are pretty much what um, the song is based around. Those those chords happen a lot, and uh, the rhythm goes one, two, three, bump, uh, bump. But well, okay, that's probably not as helpful as if I were to actually play it for you. So let's try that. One, two. I remember the first time E, da -da 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 -da, C sharp minor seven, and then you go to F sharp minor seven, and you go to B seven variation. My rhythm was off one more time. C sharp minor seven, F sharp minor seven, B seven back to E. Okay, <clears throat> so that's that. Um, next, we will move on to the pre-chorus, which um, starts like this. That's the uh, My Pulse is Racing part. And this is the third chord from uh, our four chords in the beginning. So your little Spider-Man chord. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna slide up two frets to here. So you're gonna go you're not gonna actually slide like that, like that, but you're gonna go here. Um, this is a G sharp minor seven variation, and it's got the same exact shape. You know, you're still muting this fifth string here. That's not coming through, and these two are still open. And then I do this little thing. It's a little uh, C sharp seven something. It's like that, so it looks and sounds like this, as seen in the diagram. And you're not playing these guys, you're not playing these guys, just the ones you're holding. 
The next chord in that quick little run is this. And it looks and sounds like that. And I'm holding this note with the knuckle, the first, I guess that's the first knuckle of my pointer finger, just putting it down right there. And the last one of that is a uh, C7. And that, those three chords have to happen pretty quick because it goes, right? My pulse is racing when I see you facing. Keep, right? And you'll get it over time, it's just muscle memory. Um, practice it enough times, you can play, play it no problem. Um, and then, as you go into the chorus, you do the same thing. F sharp minor 7. Here's what you're doing. That's your G sharp minor 7 from before. To me. You're going to slide up one, one fret, one half step to an A minor 7. Boom. Fifth fret. I've never said boom with guitar ever in my life. Well, technically I have. With, okay, you know. So you're not playing this. Gives you that nice um, minory sound. And then the last chord after that is this. It's a it's a variation on a B. And again, you're not playing this fifth string. This fifth string is, um, it basically just doesn't feel, I mean, it sounds nice, but it's not in the song. So we'll play it this way. And you'll see it in the diagram. It looks and sounds like that. Then you go back to your uh, to your first four chords. You can play however you want with the rhythm. You know, it's 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 your song as much as it's my song. So. Um. So yeah, that's that. Uh, let's see. What else? What else do we have to do? We have to cover. Ah, okay. So before you go to the bridge, which is the um, if ever you question my feet, you know that part. Um, you play a little something. You play a C add nine. This one I know the name of. <laughs> Not that I didn't know the name of the other ones. So you play this chord. It's gonna be. Um, my pulse is racing when I see your face and here is what you're doing to me. My love, when you, when you, when you say you love, love me, I can feel my heart beating, race behind my chest. When you, when you, when you say you love, love me, I can feel my heart beating, race behind my chest, race behind my chest. And this is where it comes in. You know that part? So that's what that looks and sounds like. It's a, it's a very common chord. Just don't play the sixth top string. Then you go back to your B7 variation. Stop. And then this is where you go to the bridge, which is a little different and uh, run out of time, so I'll speed up a little bit. You got your F sharp minor seven. You question my feelings to B7. I'll put the shapes for you. You're welcome to pause. And then place your hand on my heart. And it's basically that G sharp minor seven, but with this note, with your pointer. No is feeling for you. Yeah, remember this one? That's the one from earlier. To see C sharp seven something. And then you go like this. You go F sharp seven, cause he knows he knew before I did. G sharp minor seven. I'm not scared. I'm tired of hiding. Then you go to this uh, A minor seven variation. I know that it's you because there's your B. You remember that one? And then you slide up half the step because. And then you're up a half step. And then you have your C, C7. So I hope you enjoy and uh, 